Hey, how's it going guys? My name is Mr. Sonic Man U, and welcome back to Mermaid Swamp. Let's start. You guys already know what happened last episode. So many things happened. So let's continue and figure out what happened. What was going to happen to poor Seitaro here. Alright, Seitaro. Let's go. Let's find Rin. I seriously think he has a huge crush, crush on Rin. Like an immense crush on her. I wonder if this game has multiple endings. Because I had a choice to listen to Seitaro. But I didn't. Okay. Wait, is it just me or am I hearing things? Oh, Rin, don't be dead. Uh. Whoa. What is this? Is this a village? I didn't find this before. Woo! We're gonna be okay now. I'll borrow a phone and call for help. Um, this doesn't look like any ordinary village, bro. This looks like a very messed up place to be. I wouldn't want to be here. I wouldn't want to stick around here, bro. Where do I go? Do I go up? Obviously not. Okay. Um. Okay, so I knock. I'm gonna knock on all the doors. Damn it. Nobody here. It's an old grandma. But thank goodness someone's here. Um, excuse me, madam. We were staying at a landlord's house and a friend of ours got sick. That right? That right? There's lots of bad things in the in this house, yes. Why does she know? Huh? Um, yes, but one of our friends is sick. Is there any kind of hospital or must be sad, must be hateful, must be bitter. Are you listening? Nah dude, she's not listening, but you know, there's more frightening things there. What goes unseen is far more terrifying. Oh dude, run. Shall I tell you? You see. What the heck? That scared the heck out of Die, outsider! What? Can I run? What? What the? Damn it. Not gonna talk to strangers, huh? Ridiculous. Um. That's. That's strange. Uh. Okay. Can okay, I just keep on going? I don't like it here. Okay. Things just got weird, like, really fast. Really fast. Where's this? Uh, why are you asking? I don't know. Let me move the camera just a little bit. A grave site? Oh no, are we gonna find Rin? Are we gonna find Rin? Oh no, okay. We didn't find Rin. Okay. What's that sign say? This sign? There's a sign. It's in Japanese. The writing is really faded. Suchida family gravesite. Suchida's the old man's family, right? Give our family protection eternally. Malice. What the hell does this, this say? Seems weirder than a regular gravesite. Oh, buddy. Was there something there? Oh, um, obviously. Is the rest of the game just going to be me wandering through? I found Rin. Rin? Hey, are you okay, Rin? R Rin. Hey, what is it? Are you crying? 
Duh. Rin! Did she just die? Do you know the story? The story of the merman who died there? Pity her. Pity her. A door to her very death was go what goes unseen more terrifying than what is seen. That is why you ought not dare come near. Woe to be those who near the swamp. Whoa. You goddamn idiot. I told you not to go, didn't I? And with your lack of direction? You feeling alright? It's pretty chilly in the mountains. You better not have caught a cold. I'll get some water. You get some rest while I keep looking, okay? It's a curse. Huh? It's all the mermaid's curse. What happened to Yuka? And Yuta going nuts? The mermaid hates the people of this house, but she can't touch them, so she goes for outsiders like us. Restaurant. There's no such thing as curses, okay? You're thinking crazy things from fatigue. We'll find a map soon and get out of here. We're almost at our rope's end. We can't leave Yuka or Yuta as they are. Ugh. Oh no. Sitar, what's up? Oh no. It's nothing. Just kind of a headache. Maybe I'm the one who caught cold. This has to be the curse. I can't think of anything else. Even my weird dreams. The mermaid? But what do I do about it? And what's she trying to do to me? Mermaid? Mermaid Swamp? Uh, duh, duh, Jose. So they call it Mermaid Swamp. Swamp? Maybe there's a connection with the legend and Swamp. Oh, okay. What do I do? Let's check on you to see what's going on. No, I don't want to go in there. Okay. Maybe you have to go to the swamp. Is this swamp related to that legend? Maybe there's something in the swamp. Oh, okay. Let's jump in the swamp. I'm swimming around. I'm swimming around. Going for a swim in the swamp. Can I go left or right? Nope, I'm just gonna keep on swimming down. What's this? <gasps> I don't know what that is. What's this? A hairpin? Why is it in the swamp? Huh? Oh jeez. Oh jeez. Oh gosh. Oh no. G -g let, let go, let go. Oh. Oh, oh no, I can't breathe. Come on, come on, come on. No, 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 no. What the heck? God! Pant, pant. The damn it, you idiot. Why, what are you doing? You want to die? Pant, pant. Sisitara, how do you know I went in? I saw you on out the window. I was wondering what you were up to. Then you jumped in. Are you completely bonkers? Yeah, she is completely bonkers. Why would you jump in a swamp? And then you got a water plant around your leg and nearly drowned. Stop making me goddamn worry. I would be worried too, honestly. B but it's true. It really is a mermaid's curse. Just now, a weird black shadow got my leg. Shut up. Yeah, shut up. Okay. Mermaid's curse. This is ridiculous. Do something protective like search for a map. We can't just leave. Productive. We can't just leave Yuta alone. You're the one who needs to get a grip. It's obvious there's nothing normal about this. Not after Yuka dying, Yuta going crazy. It really is the mermaid's curse. I keep having countless dreams. Please, just believe me. You goddamn... B oh, is he gonna call her that? Ugh. Seitaro, you, your head hurting again? Yeah, maybe I caught a cold. Awful headache since I went walking around. Oh, no. It's my fault because I wandered away. So then don't do it again. I'll check more in the study. You look around too. But we can't just wait for that old man. Please. Got it. 
Oh, I didn't read the rest. The sunset set. The sun's setting. Let's call it a day. Okay, just can't sleep. I'm afraid to even dream. All right, let's explore. I gotta find some lead on getting out of here. Okay, what do we do? Where do we start? Huh? Don't look so good. He really, he really wrecked himself. Sorry. Hmm. That's just it's awful. Maybe, what do I do? Do I go out to the mansion? Let me check real quick, because I don't want to be walking around for like hours. Okay. Okay. So, here's what I'm supposed to do here <laughs> I go here, go to Mr. Yuta's dead body, get the knife, a bloody knife. Got a knife. Remember that place in the mansion where that thing was caught on? The older mansion, that is? I need to go there. And cut it. Okay. Let's see if I remember. No, it's not that one. There we go. Let me use a knife. Nefu. Oh, I just... Will I just open it automatically? The hell's it caught him? Maybe if I use a golf club. Oh, ah, there was a rod propping it. Why'd you need that for a closet? Hmm. Hmm, and a key and a scrap of paper. I found the boiler room key, but it, I won't tell this to the master. There must be something valuable. He strictly forbids entry to it. There must be something valuable there. I must check while I have the chance. Got the boiler room key. Okay, I guess I'm gonna go to the only locked door in this place. Just gonna keep on searching every single door. The door's broken, but you can't get in. Maybe if I use the key. The key. Door's broken, okay. Maybe if I go on the other side, maybe that's the boiler room. There's the boiler room. It's locked. Okay, this should be the boiler room. It's locked. It's locked. It's locked. What do I do? Let me consult the walkthrough once again. Okay. Strange thing I just figured out. But if you go here. Oh, okay. A light stand. Yes, good job. The heck? Okay, hold on. Okay. So apparently I can't do that yet. So I'm just gonna go to this room over here. Hold on. Sorry if this puzzle stuff is boring. I find it boring and I just wanna get through with it so I can get to the, the story. A fireplace. Oh, seems like floor in this fireplace is really creaky. Remove the floor? Yes, remove the floor. Oh, I don't like this. A hidden room. There's a ladder, but it don't go all the way. Rather not go unless I know how deep it is. Maybe if I had like a rope, but now nah, I got nothing to tie it to. Gotta think. Okay. And then I'm thinking I go to that bedroom now? Okay, maybe, okay, cut to the bedroom. Alright guys, I'm gonna end the episode right here. Um, I don't know what's going on, so I'll just end it right here, and I'll see you guys next time. But anyway, I hope this was eventful to you guys' liking. I know it was eventful in the beginning, but you know, the dynamic of the whole game is, you know, scary and then puzzle solving, but that puzzle solving can take really long and it gets tedious after a while. Guess that's my only complaint about this game so far, but I will finish it, so no worries. But anyway, thank you guys for watching. If you enjoyed it, make sure you hit that like button and let me know in the comments down below. And also, if you guys want to see me play more games like this, let me know in the comments down below too. I'd really like to know what you guys want me to play. I really know if there's any other good games like this out there. I know, I've heard of To The Moon. I might play that. But anyway, this is Mr. Sonic Manu, signing off. See you guys.